Learn how to get along with people, build trust, and make deep connections with them. Deep listening is a strength in the modern world. If you can make someone feel heard and important, you are on the way to their heart. It's also not as hard or complicated as you might think. How to quickly go from being a stranger to a treasured friend. How to Listen with Intent is a book about connections in the end. In a partnership, both people have to give and take. Are you taking more than you give? Do you make it easy for people to talk to you? Are you a good listener or are you a talking or relationship narcissist without realizing it? It's time to ask these hard questions and learn the skills to not only help people in need, but also make new friends with almost anyone. After all, who doesn't like to be heard? Develop your emotional intelligence and your ability to read people. Patrick Kane is a best-selling author and social skills teacher around the world. His writing comes from a lot of different places, like scientific study, academic experience, coaching, and real-life experience. Get to know people two steps below what they say. The most damaging habits for listening. How we are all biologically programmed to be bad listeners, and we have no idea why. The one person you should model your listening skills after. How hearing styles, frames, and levels can help you, and how you aren't even close to what you think you are. What active, thoughtful listening means and why it's so hard to do. Getting to know people, emotional intelligence, and understanding. Be the friend and source of comfort and understanding that people value the most. Help other people out, and they'll help you out. This book is for you if you want to improve the quality of your relationships, learn how to resolve conflicts, find out what people really want, and get into their inner groups. You are about to learn the most important social skill of all, even more important than humor and charm. How to Listen with Intention The Foundation of True Connection, Communication, and Relationships by Patrick Kane is a guide to becoming a better listener to improve communication and build stronger relationships. The book has five parts, and each one talks about a different part of hearing. Part 1. What is listening? Chapter 1. The Start This part gives an overview of how important listening is in communication and relationships and explains what it means to listen on purpose. Chapter 2. The Basics of Listening This part talks about the different kinds of listening and what makes for good listening, such as paying attention, figuring out what was said, and responding in the right way. Chapter 3. The Benefits of Listening This part talks about the benefits of listening on purpose, such as better communication, better relationships, and more personal growth. Part 2. Barriers to Listening Chapter 4. Common Things That Make It Hard to Listen This part talks about common things that make it hard to listen well, such as distractions, biases, and preconceived ideas. Chapter 5. Overcoming Barriers to Listening This part looks at active listening, empathetic listening, and reflective listening as ways to get past the things that make it hard to listen well. Part 3. Advanced Listening Skills Chapter 6. Listening with Your Mind This part talks about the practice of mindful listening. It talks about the benefits of being mindful, the different ways to practice mindfulness, and how to bring mindfulness into listening. Chapter 7. Nonverbal Listening This part talks about the importance of body language, vocal tone, and facial expressions when it comes to listening. Chapter 8. Listening for Emotion This section talks about how to listen for emotions, including how to recognize emotions, give them credit, and react in the right way. Part 4. Listening in Different Contexts Chapter 9. Listening in Personal Relationships this part talks about how important it is to listen on purpose in all kinds of personal relationships, like romantic ones, friendships, and family ties. Chapter 10. Listening in Professional Settings This part talks about how important it is to listen on purpose in the workplace, such as during job interviews, meetings, and negotiations. Chapter 11. Listening in Conflict Situations this section talks about how to use active listening, empathy, and finding common ground as ways to use intentional listening in conflict scenarios. Part 5. Conclusion Chapter 12. Conclusion This last part of the book summarizes the main points and stresses how important it is to listen on purpose in all parts of life. 
Kane uses real-world examples and case studies to show how the ideas and tactics he describes work in the real world. He also talks about how important it is to listen while being present, understanding, and not judging. He also talks about how careful listening can help build stronger relationships and better communication. The main goal of the book is to help readers become better listeners so they can improve their relationships and quality of life. Thanks for watching our Amazon book review. If you found our review helpful and you're interested in checking it out for yourself, we've included a link to it in the description below. By clicking on that link, you'll not only get more details about it on Amazon, but also support our channel at no cost to you. So go ahead and click that link to grab your copy of the book and dive into an exciting reading journey. Happy reading and thanks for your support.